Hey, YouTube Sweet Knives here. Check out another cool knife. I was sent this from uh, one of my viewers, and he said, check this out, see what you think. So I'm starting up a new series. It's called the Short and Sweet Series. And basically, what it means is we're not going to go into, like, massive in-depth review. We're just going to do quick unboxing and check this bad boy out. This is the Auto Presidio 2, model number 5700 SGY-1. Uh, without further ado, let's bust this open and give you a look. Check that out. That's a new new style sheath. That actually is uh, really nice. And here is the knife, and it actually comes with uh, this molly attachment as well and the paperwork and so forth. Uh, but look at that. Check out that. CPM M4 deep carry pocket clip. Um got a really nice um just really nice I, so this one you know some knives you wonder are they worth it are they good knives i mean i'm reviewing so many knives it's hard to it's hard to get a sense for what you truly like or what you don't like this is one that i think kicks ass um this is one that shipped to our military they actually use this in a lot of the special forces it's a heavy knife the way, it, the way the mechanism works, it's got this axis lock like regular Benchmade knives. And then it's got tension on the blade right here. There's a spring inside. I don't think we can quite see that spring, but it's in there. And the way it deploys, it can actually lock. So if you click this, now when you push back, it can't go. You can't make it go down. You have to disengage this lock. And now when you push this axis back, that's when it flips open. So very, very, very kick-ass design. I want to show you it in comparison to some other knives. I got my trusty Endura 4 ZDP. Give you a sense for how much bigger the handle is, the blade shape, so forth. I got my 940, which is not a small knife either. But as you can see, the Auto Presidio dwarfs that knife in comparison this is just a quick kind of quick unboxing video i do actually have a, another auto here uh, that i wanted to pull out this one's a little different that's the 95 90 51 another popular military um, knife which you can put the clip in multiple spots this one the clip can only go on this side so, and this one locks like that. And this one has a push button instead of the access lock. So there are other options for autos. This is also a military uh, knife that they use in the military. This one has an open frame. This one has a partial, partial open frame. Um, I like this one. I like the way it feels. I like the grip. I've always liked the Presidios. I've always thought they were good. I like the fixed blade Presidios as well. Generally, this one just feels like it's going to hold up. These are the kind of knives that will last your entire lifetime, and you'll be able to pass them down. There's no cheap plastic. There's no shitty materials. There's, you know, like even this Endura 4. I love this Endura 4, but honestly, this... Um, this aluminum, 60, 61 T6 aluminum, dwarfs the, uh, the FRN. I mean, this is lightweight, so that's, there are some benefits to the Endura 4. This is not a lightweight knife, but it is more durable, I believe, and I believe it'll hold up a little bit better over the really long term. This, you know, let's face it, I, this is a damn good knife too, but this one's just... It's not going to break. <laughs> I mean, you're not, you're not going to break this knife, at least not easily. So again, check out this bad boy. This is the Auto Presidio 5700, and it's at least a 200, maybe 250 dollar knife. Um, I do like this one a lot. Two thumbs up. I give it. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. We got a lot of cool, cool stuff coming out um, in the near future. I mean, just all kinds of really cool knives. You want to hit that subscribe button because they're, uh, you don't want to miss this stuff. In fact, I got something so cool. I just thought, what the hell? I'll show you guys a little glimpse. I'm not going to go into it, but I'm going to do this really quickly. Ready? One, two, three. 
<laughs> oh, you don't see that too often. That's a video for another day. Uh, can't wait to show you guys what's in that box, but I can't do that right now. Anyway, thanks a lot, guys. Have a good one. This is the short and sweet series. Hit that subscribe button. You don't want to miss what's coming next.